As Israel's beach season kicks off along the Mediterranean, Moshe, a lifeguard at Pamachin Beach, south of Tel Aviv, is highly alert. Temperatures are soaring and scores of Israelis flock to the shores for a cool dive. In my view, these are the most dangerous days because people are fearless and there are no closed swimming zones. Everyone swims freely wherever they feel like. On top of his heightened senses, Moshe has some special help as well, an Israeli patent that turns the area under his control into a smart zone. The SiteBit startup has developed a technology of smart cameras that can monitor any unusual event in or around the water and instantly alert the lifeguard. The system can identify and monitor threats like a child who is left alone, a current or a drowning person. The system can also identify and predict situations before they happen, for instance, certain areas that are known as high risk for drowning, where there's a strong current and can provide this info to the lifeguard or rescue team to use. We wanted to see how this works and asked Mina, a member of the company, to pretend to be drowning and asked Moshi's lifeguard team to act as if this is a real-time event. The system identifies drowning. Go! Approximately 30 people drown on Israel's shores every year. In the U.S., there are approximately 4,000 total drowning or near-drowning incidents annually. A major source of concern are undeclared beaches where no lifeguards are present to protect the swimmers. Our system can operate also in those beaches where there's no rescue personnel on duty. Instead, emergency call centers will receive the alert and manage the situation. Israel's Park and Nature Authority has adopted the new system, hoping to make it an integral part of Israel's shorelines. We want this system to assist our lifeguards, expand their range of vision and make it easier for them to locate cases of drowning and other extreme events. They are taking away your job. If something can help us save human lives, we're happy to examine this technology. 2020, the future is already here. Let's see how it works.